How's it going guys, James to Crypto here and today I'm going to be talking about Bitcoin Cash, its growth, its crazy growth and how Bitcoin is declining harder than it's ever declined ever in its entire history. It's never crashed this greatly and it's quite obvious why it's crashing this greatly. As you can see, Bitcoin Cash's volume for 24 hours is higher than Bitcoin's volume for 24 hours. That means there's a whole bunch of people grabbing their Bitcoin and taking it to Bitcoin Cash. That is crazy. If you guys want to know the reason why Bitcoin Cash is getting so much momentum and stuff, watch my last video. But as of right now, when I'm recording this video, uh, the Bitcoin Cash price is 2,209 and Bitcoin's price went from 7,600 or so all the way down to 5,707 and it, it might actually keep going down sadly and bitcoin cash might actually keep going up so what does this mean well personally to be honest guys my specific opinion um this is like the first time that i'm actually worried about bitcoin's future i've never been worried about bitcoin's future because i never saw any altcoins or any anything that can actually go over bitcoin but this kind of momentum, honestly, all it takes is for companies to start adopting Bitcoin Cash by a lot. I mean, like as much companies as Bitcoin has been adopted with Bitcoin Cash having that same kind of adoption. That's really all it takes. They just need that kind of adoption and they would definitely become the next Bitcoin for sure. For sure. At this kind of momentum, then yeah, it's very possible. But that's what it would take. But for something like that to actually happen, remember, there's some big companies that support Bitcoin. I'm talking about Microsoft, Steam, you know, like Newegg. These companies support Bitcoin. You could pay with Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash is, is just an anomaly. It's something very different from, you know, the normal. So uh, it's, it's pretty crazy to see Bitcoin Cash growing this highly. If you have been holding Bitcoin Cash, then this is the break that you've been wanting, obviously. With these kind of returns, it's just amazing. I actually have not purchased any Bitcoin Cash because honestly, I don't want to support this whole movement of Bitcoin Cash. Uh, even though Bitcoin Cash may be better than normal Bitcoin, Bitcoin may be better than Bitcoin Cash. It really doesn't matter to me. What matters to me is that the crypto space is always standing and always being strong. And it requires Bitcoin for that. As you can see, there's a lot of altcoins like NAM and Z, you know, uh, BitConnect. Uh, look at all these kind of like 14, 18, 17, 21, 18. There's so many altcoins that are being affected by Bitcoin's very low price right now. And, uh, you know, there's, like I said uh, before in, in, in past videos, altcoins are supported by Bitcoin. You know what I mean? So if people start trading that Bitcoin is now Bitcoin Cash, well, we're going to see a lot of different things. Like I said, it really just needs a, a full wide adoption. But at this point in time, it is just too early to say, even though this is just crazy fast, it's literally a from one day to the next kind of thing. But honestly, still, it's just too early to say, OK, Bitcoin Cash is obviously going to take over Bitcoin because Bitcoin works so hard to get to around 2200 uh from when it was 2200 took years and bitcoin cash just from a day to the next so uh honestly it's just too early to say if bitcoin cash is going to be over bitcoin but this is the first time out of the entire time that i've been in the crypto space and talking about it and studying about it and all that good stuff this is the first time where i'm actually a little uh i guess nervous if Bitcoin will actually be overthrown by Bitcoin Cash. I never, like I said, I've never said that Bitcoin will ever, I, I always said Bitcoin will always be the number one constantly. It'll go 10, 20 K, but you know what? Um, I really never saw this coming. I don't think anybody has saw this coming. There's, don't, there's not one person in the crypto space that would have definitely saw this coming at exactly how it happened. Not one person. Maybe some people said, oh, Bitcoin Cash is going to be better than Bitcoin and people are going to start using Bitcoin Cash more in the future, stuff like that. But nobody would have thought it would have happened from one day to the next kind of thing where people are just dumping Bitcoin and going to Bitcoin Cash. But like I said, it's too early to tell if Bitcoin Cash will overthrow Bitcoin. All I know is that that's some sheep ass Bitcoin right now. And you guys, 
including me, should invest into that because that's good. That's really good. Uh, as far as Bitcoin Cash, I think you should invest in it. I think this is definitely a very huge indication that even if Bitcoin Cash will most likely start going down after this huge, huge trend up, because as we know, when things grow really fast, it's going to come down eventually. Uh, and then it'll go back up. That's that's how Bitcoin goes. But let's see how Bitcoin Cash goes. But um, this kind of momentum, this 131% increase, it'll eventually start going down a little bit, you know, a little, a lot of bit. It won't stay at 2000 for long. There's not much like backing that up. The only thing that's backing that up is everybody's scared that Bitcoin cash is going to be the next Bitcoin. So everybody's just like, oh, let's get all our Bitcoin and put it in Bitcoin cash. Everybody's thinking that right now. That's why the volume of Bitcoin cash is at 10 billion in 24 hours. It's not because, oh, people are using it as a transaction, stuff like that. It's not, it's not implemented like that. It's not adopted like that. It's literally because there's so many people that are just kind of scared about Bitcoin being overthrown by Bitcoin Cash and they don't want to lose money. So they're putting their money on Bitcoin Cash, which is a good idea, I guess, at the moment, because you, you could actually make good profit off of this. Um, but like I said, it'll eventually go down. So if you guys see the price right now, uh, when you watch this video, or if you see it at 3000 or 2500 you're going to want to sell that. I mean, like sell it immediately when you see that guys because it will go down and you will not gain the huge profits that you gain sell it all to either bitcoin or your favorite altcoin or i don't know what but bitcoin cash cannot have that stable kind of uh price without anything adopting it as high as bitcoin has been adopted so that's my thoughts into it guys you guys can think what you want um but yeah, it's 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 uh, crazy times in crypto, and this has never happened uh, out of Bitcoin's entire existence, where it's actually threatened, uh, like a real threat, you know. So it's gonna be interesting these coming days how things are gonna be. I'm definitely gonna be talking about this way more, guys. So make sure you guys subscribe. Um, I'll definitely be talking about if you know Bitcoin Cash is, if Bitcoin Cash actually grows over Bitcoin, then I'll share my thoughts on that when that comes. But for now, all I can say is let's wait patiently and see what happens. If you have Bitcoin Cash, you're either going to want to sell it as high as now or if it grows any higher, you want to sell it at then. That's, the, you know, to recap. And if you want to purchase Bitcoin, I think you should because the price will go up again. And then once it goes up again, well, you made profit again. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let, let, let's actually look into some specific things. Let me see on my time. I'm still good on time, kind of. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Bam. Let's let's just look at it in one year. Okay. I don't even think it hasn't been around for three for a year. That's right. Let's look at it from a month. From one month, guys. Okay, let's wait for the the data from and Bitcoin's price going down so drastically is going to affect a lot of companies' income. Which is, I really hope I don't see some companies uh, shutting down if Bitcoin goes too, too down. Uh, there was a crash once of Bitcoin where Bitcoin mining wasn't that profitable anymore. And a lot of people have to shut, had to shut down their farms. I would really hate to see some really nice companies just shutting down. Remember, Genesis Mining's contract is until profitable. Well, what if it's no longer profitable because Bitcoin keeps crashing? Well, that would really suck, wouldn't it? Um, okay, so look. Right here, November 10, we're in November 12, two days, 659, freaking 2,446. In two days, that's that's just not, that's not, uh, that's not right. This is crazy, you know? So, um, and then let's look at Bitcoin's trend going down. Actually, we're going to look at it in the better chart that I have here. We're going to look at Bitcoin in better charts. Okay, here we are in my better chart. I call it better chart. Uh, let me let me actually move this over here, and then I'm going to go here. I'm gonna log in. We're gonna click that one. Okay, here we go. Okay, no thanks. All right. So here we are in Bitcoin. Bitcoin, as we know, just trending down. Whoa, trending really down. I didn't even see that part. But we're going to put each candle like if it was four hours. Just to see a more, you know, better trend down. 
so right over here this is when bitcoin was just kind of doing its thing normal thing going up like always and then right around here around the same time that bitcoin cash started growing momentum right here look at this literally right here around november 10 the second right here november 10 the second that bitcoin cash started growing up bitcoin started going way way down and like i said people are just selling their bitcoin to bitcoin cash that's literally what they're doing so like i said there's not enough adoption for bitcoin cash to just stay where it's at it's going to go down eventually and bitcoin has already all the adoption and all the good stuff and everything like that so eventually bitcoin will go up once people start selling their bitcoin cash back to bitcoin or to other altcoins and stuff like that it this is this is just what's going to happen of course but like i said it's a beautiful time to purchase bitcoin i see this shit as a discount all right, guys. So I just wanted to show you guys in a more in-depth kind of form in, uh, of the charts and stuff like that. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I do daily cryptocurrency videos, so make sure you guys subscribe. I have passive income ways that I use myself to be able to make money. So make sure you check that out in the description below. And I'll be seeing you guys on my next video. Take care.